anything. So that's why I removed such students so that they don't waste their time here. Aus billahi min shaitani rajim. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Al-Wahdatul Ula, first unit. At-Tahiyatu Ta'aruf, greetings and introduction. Ad-Darsu Samin, eighth lesson. Al-Kira'a, reading. Atadribula Wolf, first exercise. Unzur Vastame Wakra. Look and listen and read. Who is the first one today? I think it's Vidad. Read this and tell me their meaning. Hello? Yes. Yeah, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you now. Okay. So you want me to read the pictures? Yes. Okay. Anna, I. Anta, you for a male. Anti, you for a female. Hua, he. Hia, she. Talib, student. Mudarris, teacher. Abiba, Abiba, uh, a doctor. Mohandisa, engineer for a female. Hada, this for a male. Hadihi. This for a female. This question is not needed, so we will not do it. Here is just asking us to put a check mark in front of the similar word. No need to do this one as well. Same question. No need to do this one as well. This is also useless. Look and listen and read. So, Jawad. Hua Talib. This is a student. He is a student. He is a student. He is a Taliba. She is a student. Hua Mudarris. He is a teacher. He is a modarisa. She is a teacher. Ana Turki. I am Turkish. Ana means Surya. I am from uh, Syria. Ana Mohandis. I am engineer. Ana means Pakistan. I am from Pakistan. He is Misriya. She is from Egypt. She, she is Egyptian. Egyptian. She is. So this is for writing practice. And I recommend you to do this exercise because it looks easy, but it will improve your writing. So here, what will you do? You will just pass your pen like this from right to left. Okay. And then again, he's asking you, I will rest me on a nukad repeat by practicing by drawing on the dots. So again, you will just join these dots from right to left. So you need to do it. Then naktubu min ala ila asfala hakaza. We write from top to bottom. I also recommend you to practice this from top to bottom as your homework. And then I recommend you to do this one as well. Just pass your pen, move your pen on these dots. Then also practice this exercise. This will improve your writing, inshallah. Okay. Then there are some words here. No need to do again. You need to just pass your pen on these for writing practice. Okay. Just like this, you will pass your pen, you will move your pen on this. 
in sakhmin copy so here you need to write these letters on these blanks so make sure that alif hamza will touch the line but it will not go below the line similarly dal will touch the line but it will not go below the line zal will also touch the line but it will not go below the line if anyone write, uh, uh, write like this it is wrong because it must not go below the line if anyone write it above the line still it is wrong so you cannot write like this okay but this one is correct because it is touching the line but it is not going below the line so in this way you need to practice it okay so you need to fill this by writing these letters on these blanks let me ask you whether you are understanding something or not Miss Karima, what did I told? What did I tell here? Uh, you just said that uh, we should uh, write the uh, alif uh, in the same way that is written there, uh, not going below the line, but just touching the line. And the dal should not go crooked; it should be straight. And the dal also it should be straight. And is that right? It should touch the line, and it should not go below the line. Okay below the line. That's right. Yes. Sorry. So we cannot take it below the line. Atadrib Salis Murra Vikala Mikala Kadima. Pass your pen, move your pen on these words. So again, you will just practice it by moving your pen on these. Okay. So you can do it. Then again, you will copy these pen words here and make sure that Amza, Noon, and Alif, they will touch the line, but they will not go below the line, okay? If I write like this, okay, then Sala, Seen, Amza will touch the line, but they will not go below the line. But the Lam will go below the line, okay? So note the difference here. Seen and Alif Hamza are touching the line, but they are not going below the line. But Lam is going below the line as well. Okay. Then Dal. Dal will touch the line. It will not go below the line. Alif will touch the line. It must not go below the line. Ra. Half of it will be slightly below the line and rest of the above the line. You need to keep this thing in your mind. Then Mudaris Mim will touch the line. Dal will touch the line and it must not go below the line. But Ra will go half below the line slightly. Then Seen Teeth touching the line. But this part half below the line so you need to practice like this okay wahid wow mouth touching the line half below the line alif touching the line ha touching the line and dal also touching the line so here only half of the wow is going below the line the rest of the words are touching the line but they cannot go below the line okay so if i write Amza below the line, noon above the line, lam, then it will be wrong. So you need to write it like this. Okay. Any more? Any question? Then you, again, you will practice by moving your pen on these letters for writing practice. This will improve your writing, inshallah. Then you will write them here. Ra, you see, half part slightly below the line, rest above the line. Za, half below the line and rest above the line. Wow, 
mouth above the line and rest of the half below the line. So if I write completely above or completely below, it is wrong. Same thing for wrong. If I write above, if I write below, it will be wrong. This one is correct. Okay. Pass your pen on the words. So again, you practice your writing here. So you just pass your pen on these words. It will improve your writing. Here, raw, you see this part above the line, this part below the line, this part touching the line. This pop teeth above the line, touching the line, and rest below the line. Turkey, like this. Ta, touching the line. Ra, below the line. Kaf, touching the line. Ya, below the line, like this. Zainab, Zaya, slightly below and half above the line. Ya, Noon, Ba will touch the line, but they will not go below the line. Azam Ain will touch the line, Za will touch the line, Mim mouth will touch the line and rest below the line. Okay. In this way, you need to practice writing. Again, you will pass your pen on these letters. You can skip this question. You can skip this one as well. You can skip this one as well. So here we alhamdulillah completed the first unit of the book. Here you learned how to greet someone in Arabic, how to introduce someone in Arabic. Mr. Muhammad Anas. Mr. Musa. Uh, yes. yes, sir. Yes. Muhammad Anas. Okay, Muhammad Anas and Mr. Musa. Yes. You both need to first greet each other, then ask name and ask condition, ask nationality, ask country. Okay, ask this question to each other. Start. Mr. Muhammad Anas, ask yes, sir. Mr. Musa. First, Assalamu greet. alaikum. First greeting. Walaikum. Walaikum salam. Ismi Musa Masmuk. Masmuk. Ismi Muhammad Anas. Kaifa haluk? Alhamdulillah. The khair. Min aina ant? أنا من الهند من أين أنت؟ أنا من مالديف Now ask about nationality ما جنسية ما جنسية توك جنسية توك أنا مالديفي وأنت أنا هندي أنا هندي okay. هندي now tell him about حلوك. your brother what is his profession and what is his name مسمو ألاك أخون هذا what is the name of your brother Brother, brother, Akhi, Akhi Abdullah. Mother, it's more a hooker. You will tell him Abdullah. Abdullah. He has a he Abdullah. And what is his profession? Mother is an who were mother is. So you will say, Mother is he Abdullah. Who were mother is. Then the other student will welcome him. 
ahlan wa sahlan ahlan wa sahlan now the other student will tell about his father name and profession my father name sir yes name and profession ismuhu ash sheikh abdur rahman let's assume he is standing here so you will say haza abi sheikh abi haza abi ash sheikh abdur rahman bin mohammed miran wa mudarris wa wa mudarris fi kulliyat al arabiyat al jamaliya now welcome him ahlan wa sahlan okay in this way you will do the dialogues Ms. Nafisa, yes. Ms. Nurul Jamal, uh, 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 greet each other. Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum salam. Now ask about name. Ma Ismuki. Ma Ismuki. Ma Ismuki. Ismi Nafisa Muhammad. Ask this thing. Ma aina anti. Man aina anti. Do you see the whiteboard? Miss, do you see the whiteboard? Kay fa haluki. Kay fa haluki. Lihai ro alhamdulillah. Nafisa, ask the same question. ghana Anna. Okay. Anna, Anna Gania. Anna Gania. No, no, Fisa, you ask her nationality. Margin Yatiki. Anna Pakistania. Now you tell her about your sister, name and profession. Hazi Ukti. Iya. What is the name about? Hazi um, Ukti Fatima. Hiya Fatima. Nafisa, welcome her. Ahala Wasala. Now you Ahla can learn about your mother and her profession. Please, what you say? Sorry. I didn't hear what you said. Tell her about your mother, name and profession. Hazi hi ummi Aisha tu. Here Tobiba. Hazi hi ummi. Okay. Ah, Nur Jana, welcome her. Ahlan wa sahla. Okay. Hello, what's up? What is this poor name? Yes, sir. And Rahad Naz. Yes, sir. Greet each other. Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum assalam. Wa alaikum assalam. Kaif halak? Kaif halki? Bikhairin wa alhamdulillah. Kaif haluki? I am Bakhir Alhamdulillah. Now ask about name. Ma Ismuki. Ismi Rahat Naz. Ma Ismuki. Ma Ismuki. Ana Bunam. Ana Min Alhim. Ma Jin Siyatuki. Ana Alhimdi. Anna Hindiya. 
Miss Sabina, tell me word by word meaning. Assalamualaikum. Waalaikum assalam. Isnan is uh, second. Second. Isnan mean two. Isnan mean two. Two. Ah is brother. Ukta is sister. Arba is four. This means name. Allah is our Lord. Ana means I. Anta. Anta is you, male. Anti is you, female. Ahla wa sahlan is welcome. Pakistani means Pakistan. Pakistani man. Pakistani man. Uh, I am fine. Next, Miss Shamiro Masigo. Now, <clears> Talata <throat> Tun is three. Jin Jinsiya Jinsiya Tu nationality. Alhamdulillah. Praise be to the praise be to Allah. Khamsatu is five. Assalamu alaikum is sending greetings like peace be alaykum. upon you. Peace be upon you. Swadiqun uh, is telling is the truth. Friend. Sadiq means male friend. Swadiq means male friend. Swadiqatu is a female friend. Tawadibatu. Tawadibatu is a, a female student. Tawaliba is a male student. Tabiba. Tabiba is Tabiba is a male is a female, female doctor. doctor. Yeah. Female doctor. So Biba is a female doctor. Whenever we stop at Tamil Buddha, we pronounce ha. So if anyone says Sadiqa Tun, it is wrong. You better say Sadiqa. Taliba. Tabiba. Read this words again. Yeah. Sadiqa. Taliba. Tabiba. Correct. So we thar. Assalamualaikum. Wa alaikum assalam. Read this. 
Word by word meaning. Ka. You. Your. Your. Your for me. Um, al mukhatab. Al mukhat. Al mukhatab. Second person male. Second person male. Ki al mukhatib. Al mukhatiba. Second person female. Give a hello. How are you? For uh, give a hello. Ka. How are you for me? For for me. Give a hello. Ki. How are you for female? La Hurufi Jer La for for and Hurufa for Jer mean preposition. Preposition Ma uh, what Ms. Muka, uh, what is your name for? Correct. What is your name? Next student, Vidad. Assalamualaikum. Waalaikum salam. Um, Masmuka, what is your name for a male? Masmuki, what is your name for a female? Majun Siatuk, what is your nationality for a male? Majun Siatiki, Majun Siatuki. What is your nationality for a female? Mudarris, a teacher for male. Ma'asalama, goodbye. Min, uh, from. Min Aina, where are you from? Min Aina, from where? Min, min Aina, uh, yeah, Min here. Aina, from where? Yeah, from where? Next, we have Umme Anas. Umme Anas. Adugba Muftau. Adugba Muftau. You. Miss you. Mr. Arnold Rias. Mr. Arnold Rias, Miss Hafsa, Miss Hafsa, Mr. Jawad. Is everybody sleeping or what happened? Miss Karima. Yes, sir. Yes. Okay, read this. Mohandis. This means engineer. Nam means yes. Aza means this. Has he means this for a girl. Hal means what? Ua means he. Here means she. Wa al Wahid means one. Wa means and. Wa means and. And alatav means conjunction. Wa means and. And alatav means conjunction. Wahid means one. Wa alaikum salam. Greeting. Ya ya al mutakallim. Ya means my. Okay. Ya means my. Ya of first person. Okay. Ya means why my and ya al mutakalle means first person. Yes. Ya, this is for female. Nationality. Male nationality. Ya nasaba. Nisba is for nationality. This is for nationality. Ya al mukhataba. This is ya for second person female. Yeah. This is yeah for second person female. Female. 
if anybody has any question they can ask me now hello yes you know how you said after like uh, uh, a is okay uh, al -atif? yeah the al -atif. yes what wa did you say that was atav mean conjunction conjunction and ex can you send an example so just have an idea like i and ali are going to oh Mecca. oh what join it okay yes okay that's good so that thing, thing is gone conjunction thanks anybody any question yeah assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah wa alaikum wa salam wa rahmatullah uh, you didn't understand this um, after ya al mutaqallam al sorry these are the three different types of ya let me try to write someone here Ya mutakallim means first person, like I say, ismi, kitabi, akhi. These are the example of ya mutakallim. So this ya mutakallim means ya of first person. So this ya means my. Meaning of this ya is my. Then this ya is ya of nationality. Like we say, Pakistani. Turkey, Nigeria. So these are the example of Yaw Nisba. Then the third one is Yaw Mukhatiba, female. So I, I don't think you have studied this, but they have still written it here. I will give you an example like Tazabina. But you have not studied it yet, so don't need to worry about Yal Mukhatiba at the moment. Okay, we'll study it later in class. Okay. Anybody, any question? I think you don't have any more questions, so we will stop here. And next time, inshallah, we will continue. So see you all next time. Ma salama. Now I will check the homeworks. So if anyone want to anyone want to see homework, join the meeting again using the same link. Okay. Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum as salam. Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum salam. Assalamu alaikum. Please accumulate to the class. Hello, sir. Sorry. I came late to the class. Please, okay. can you release the recording? Okay, I will send the recording in the WhatsApp group, okay? Okay, please do it quickly, sir. Okay. Uh, thank you, sir. You're welcome. Now I will check the homework. If anyone wants to see the homework, checking, they can join again using the same link, okay? Ma salama. I will start right now.